And yes, in this portion we have the account of the ten plagues. And as you know, during the Seder, when we read the Haggadah, we recite the history of the Exodus, the ten plagues, and as we say the ten plagues, the blood, the frogs, the lice, you know, all ten plagues, there's an interesting custom. And that is to diminish the amount of wine in the cup. Some people have the practice that each time they mention one of the plagues, they pour a little wine off. Others have the custom of dipping the finger in and taking a little wine off from that. That's symbolic. And the symbolism is, yes, we were crushed by our cruel enemy. And yes, the enemy had to be punished, but it hurts us even to punish the enemy. It's interesting that the Midrash says that when the Israelites crossed the Reed Sea, and after the sea was divided and the Egyptians came in, the waters came back in and covered the Egyptians and drowned them. The Midrash says that the angels wanted to sing praises to God for this great miracle, and God silenced them. And he said, my creations are drowning, and you want to sing my praises. It hurt God that it was necessary to destroy his own creations. You know, just a number of years ago, Golda Meir, the Prime Minister of Israel then, said, yes, our neighbors are our enemies and they want to destroy us. And of course, we're very angry at them for that. But that is not why I hate them. I hate them because they forced us to teach our children how to kill. And the message of Decreasing the amount of wine we have in the cup when reciting the plagues is, yes, it was necessary. It was a necessary method to put the pressure on Pharaoh to release the Israelites. But it takes away a little from us. Even when we must hurt the enemy, we feel badly that we have to do it. And we wish we did not have to do that. We wish that our enemies would leave us alone. Let us survive. We don't want to kill them. We don't want to hurt them. Don't put us in a position where we are forced to do so. That's the symbolism of decreasing the amount of wine in our cups when reciting the ten plagues to show that even though we are inflicting punishment on our worst enemies, it still hurts us to do so and decreases our own welfare.